hey what's up guys welcome back to the cool graphic design training once again i believe we're doing great today so i'm going to show you how you can how you can make an advert flyer on your android smartphone using your pc lab as usual this is a very simple and straightforward art flyer which you can make whether you are a designer this will give you more inspiration i'm going to combine all these elements to form a bring out this particular professional art flyer using your smartphone for that matter so whether you are if you are using an android phone smartphone iphone user you can get it helps from here even if you are a self learner trying to build yourself mentor yourself to be uh one of the best graphic designer outside there it's always good to learn on that someone so that because that time experience really matter but you need to watch this because it will added more value to yourself. So without wasting much of our time, let's get started. I have all the, all the resources which I'm going to use. And what do I mean by resources? Like background. I've thought about the font I'm going to combine. I'm going to share with you how I normally come up with these. There is a reason for every element or object being you combined together here. There are many things that we need to master we need to understand before you can come up with a design and this this one we uh, uh, those are the skills knowledge that will make your own design superb and different from others take you for instance i have some things which i've done behind the screen for instance there are some effort i thought about the color that's the first thing and that color i got the inspiration from the uh the ice cream because the flyer is all about the ice cream so ice cream I have that the touch of color then i come up with that then after that since i look at the cream color then i blend the background together since Priscilla cannot do that so i decided to improvise by uh, 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 reduce the opacity making it work and this is what i'm talking about set up your size to square size this is 120 by 1280 this is a custom size then you go back to this this is what i'm talking about when you look at this what i did here is what we call a gradient so i come to my gradient and i select this when you select this let me show you what i'm talking about if you select something like this let us zoom you select something like this okay then here what you need to just select is white or something like cream so when you select this cream then you should be able to get this result and this is how i come up with the, that particular uh, uh, uh this particular background then i go for that by uh search of a pattern that pattern was placed at the middle then when i place at the middle i use opacity to reduce it then this was formed as the background then after that look at the color how i got that color then i have this uh you can see this ice cream i have a touch of color both the cream and the other color which was combined together this is how i got that particular color then i look at see that uh, if i make all the edges somehow deep then the middle one if i make it more lighter it will obvious it will make this ice cream to be obvious then after that being said i look at the font i can use what kind of a font so i'm thinking of using uh, uh Ital italy font that will make uh, uh the design noticeable so i look at it this we say let's say we say two days okay this is two days then i have um a font to my mind which is make my words make my words will be the best for that you can use any other font you don't only make my word that is a uh, italized uh italic font you, there are others outside there but i prefer to use this okay so we have what we call a make my words so we say today's which you can see so we don't use comma we use the apostrophe while you have your result like this go to your padding to make all the fonts shown and obvious padding will move it to the left and right for all the text uh, uh, to be able to have space to showcase now i'm maintaining the same fonts i have to make this one bigger a little bit so we have a special when you look at the background which i form is somehow deep when you look at it the edges are somehow deep so i need to use a color that is lighter 
so that at least it will be able to be obvious. And uh, the special which I just typed is what I want people to see that this thing is special today. So they need to notice that. So I'm using this color will make it uh, more obvious. Then after that, there are some other things which I need to attach to make it uh, look real. Okay. So now position that here. After you are able to position that, then the next thing you need to do you need to shift this up a little bit so that it will have a more space to deal with other uh, or write up so after you are able to position that here you quickly do some more uh, retouching by go to the shadow apply a shadow and reduce the opacity to your best text the blur radius always whenever you are making your design don't let your blur radius exceed five between four and five for you to get the accurate result enable the outer glow notes your outer glow you don't have anything to do with offset x at time but whenever you are making even like a logo flyer and all that only if you are trying to make a text effect don't do with the offset x offset y that is a drop down shadow so you should be dealing with that give it something like five or six why this should not be more than blood radio should not be more than form five to kill the rest i mean to make the, the the good come out from here tap on the plus sign after you must have set those one it then reduce the lower part color bucket reduce the back to something near the hedge okay the start and when you are looking at the result you will see that shade will come out and we, we, we actually speak exactly for itself are you getting it? It will, it will really speak for itself. Uh, and when you look at it, you can see that you apply shadow, not other way around. And it won't be too dark. It won't be too, uh, 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 too, be too lighter. So now we need to type uh, the name of what we are even talking about. That is ice cream. So I copy this to save myself from stress. Okay. And that's the reason why I type, I type this. So since I've typed this, I don't need to apply shadow anymore. Only thing I just need is to change the color to white. Remember, um, why you might be thinking that uh, how do I got uh, uh, the color being combined? This is just a, a psychological stuff, okay? So why I got the color are so simple. You think about the, uh, what do they call it? You think about, um, uh, think about the, uh, uh the background how the background look like so you can see categorical that the background are so deep so i don't need to, you can't expect me to place uh, uh a deep background i mean a light color on top of a deep background since the background is deep so one thing i would just be thinking is a kind of a light background that will go with this it's like i wear this background is like i i wore a trouser then what kind of a, uh, a color shirt i can place on it so if i put something lighter it will make everything obvious so one will not affect the another one and that is how this work that is how it will work and if you look at the ice cream it has a touch of this uh yellow but it's somehow lighter and that is the reason why i put somehow deeper there but still lighter is a category of a color that are lighter but deeper in uh, in, in, in uh in the those color family so that is uh the tricks behind that so after you are able to set up this you can increase depends on uh, how you want it so after the increment make sure that you set well then you will have it lock so when you lock it you can reduce this a little bit then when you reduce manually adjust how you want everything to look like so we can still do a little uh, uh stuff here by applying a shadow to make all this to make this one work well you can select the previous one you have used and that's the reason i always have it at the back of my mind that my offset is something like five why my blur radio should be four then i have to drag this towards the end will give me the result so once i get that i don't even fucking care about what will be the outcome because i believe that uh, i must get the exact result which i wanted so after that has been done then the next thing i need to do is to just uh just position this here then i have the whole result at my hand so i can shift this one up a little bit to make it uh, look uh, uh, uh awesome okay
perfect so now after that i need to put other elements to make this one work and make it noticeable so i have this pattern of a thing from what i've used in my design before but where i got it is very simple just go to your png egg and you tap a uh, 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 pattern then you could you can scroll up and down then you will see uh, the results exactly as you want it so it's just as simple as that so and i uh, one thing is that uh, people do ask what is the name call i don't even know what the name call but through uh searching uh, that is how you do got uh, some of this stuff okay so you can do your own searching as well you will come across something relating to that once you put it at the back of your mind that uh, anytime you need something of such you can actually see it so i do come up with something like that so uh we are trying to adjust something okay so adjust this very well so that you have more space make sure that uh, this one is really positioned okay then we shift it after that we shift the ice cream up shift it up so when you shift the ice cream up it should be um You don't need to lock, you just arrange your to make the whole things work out. So we can just do this, reduce this a bit too. Then you position, okay, fine. Then you look at this one at the top. So lock the special, lock the ice cream, adjust this to this top. So when you adjust, reposition. So manually adjust them. Okay, when you manually adjust, you should be able to have this result. Perfect. Then you make sure that uh, everything is a uh, is lock. Okay, good. So after that has been done, we need uh, something to spice up the old flyer. This was gotten. Don't mind me. You might be thinking about I got uh, this particular two shape you look at it it's the same thing i just download this uh, 3d love and the one i got you be wondering about the color very simple i filter the color to switch this since i already have the color in my mind then i filter it until when it change and how did i filter it i just come to color vita the hue you can see it's changing so the hue is what i just changed then i blur it using a uh, pscc touch PSCC touch uh, which I've been showing you many tutorials on how to do the blur so after that I uh, pulled that this was gotten to on PNG hack as uh, usual so you have this one lock and then you put some right or inside use a sosam pro sosam pro as a font yeah so the sosam pro they are uh, two they are family font name which has a different category. As I do explain about the font type, so when you come to the font, you type Sosan. Look at it. You will see the. You see, it has a a, a lot of Sosan, and which means this Sosan is a is a font family name. Like for instance, if you are bearing just uh, uh, let's say Zacchaeus, Zacchaeus, if it is your surname, remember you will have a sister, you have a brother bearing surname. And all of you cannot look the same. You will look different. We have some people among you that are so brilliant. Some will not be brilliant. Some will be fat. Some will not be fat in physical appearance. The same thing I be able to all this from. You see the Sosam Pro Extra Light, Sosam Pro Semi Bold. The same thing you are bearing Zacchaeus Julius. Another person will be bearing Zacchaeus Iabo. Another person will be bearing Zacchaeus john you understand that is what the source and i mean all these font family at time normally and there are some that will not be appearing family name it is just uh let's say we are talking about barre a font that does not have a family it is only that particular font you can't see any type of that font those are the font that we normally find some font that can go along with them but like for this one we don't need to watch stress ourselves since the one i want i want this one that is not really fat 
so i will put it at the top here then i need another one that will be what that will be fat because of hierarchy i want only only what the money i'm going to put there is what i want people to see clearly so i will just say only for or let's say only 5.90 dollar okay only 5.90 dollar then when you look at it there won't be even differentiation between the two another problem is this when you encounter something like this in pc lab uh, uh it's frustrating you can go to recover auto shape then you are going to click the last one then after that your presence action is what you will not just say and that one save you from starting from beginning again so we have 5.90 dollar so you won't encounter such a problem anymore go to your font select a font you don't use a source hand which you used before you use the one that i, I, I mean fatter fatter than the previous one and when you can see there is which difference between the two then after giving it a hierarchy by making the font you select for that one fat you still need to go to the color and make the color to stand out you understand both are lighter color but you can see that uh, one is more obvious than the second one so after that we need some uh, element element seed which i downloaded as well then i make sure that i blur it to make the whole design spice up you understand then after that the next thing i want to do i have this creamy stuff which was downloaded as well on the png hack i just came across them then when i came my course and i've been seeing many design that uh, look perfectly like mine so since i've been seeing design like that so i don't even give a fucking damn immediately i saw the uh, uh, this ice cream i know what to search for and everything will look uh, look awesome so at the end of the day what i need to do is to put some uh, contact to make the whole work uh, easy and uh, noticeable and because what is the essence of the advert without that so i have what we call uh, this shape which i did it might look simple but i it follow a lot of processes like uh, i use what we call an inner shadow to make everything look like it a bean then after that i i pair my color and i make sure that i fit it to make sure that uh, the thing really work along with uh with the way i want it to be so after that has been done so i have to put uh, the social pro as well by copy by going to the uh, font type then i will have order now that is one of the common ways used whenever you are making a kind of a uh, advert online or a poster so i'll use a source hand that is not what that is bold enough so when i use it the reason why we use a font that is bold is because i have to reduce the size so if i use a tiny font everything will seem not clear so that's the reason why you have to be considerable and you need to uh, understand and uh, no reason why things look at this one now that's why the fact that the font is huge after reduction you look at how small it is you have you can read it now but if i use a font that is not fat enough you will see that everything will seem disappear if you are the kind that normally even edit your design after your design edit it to make it retain the quality you will discover that even during the process all these text we started feeding and that will not speak good well of you so now you go to the only only is what i can use now because i believe only we uh, uh is longer because i want to put uh, um uh i want to put the the web address so we just have a funny we have a stylish 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 cream dot com so this is for educational sake anyway just like and subscribe and uh, don't forget to turn on the bell icon so that you won't miss any of my amazing video like this i'm consistent now so i'm deliver back to back so you can keep on checking back every hours you are going to be seeing me uh, a lot of uh, uh, inspiration from my design and uh, I will try as much as possible based on people complain to make sure that uh, I deliver explaining everything in uh, details like this. Most especially at times uh, because of the noise here and there. So I can just uh, 
that's what i do and i don't want to disappoint you guys so i do make sure that uh, i deliver something so i have to provide even without uh, uh or using voice which i believe you guys can get so but there is no any cause of alarm at least uh, 99 percent of the videos will be used to uh will be explaining it just as perfect as this so we just put our no number 37 so putting the number i made the number to somehow both so that's how we give an hierarchy hierarchy means uh treating uh, an object accordingly you understand and when you treat them accordingly how do you know which one will come first you look at how important they are to you what is important here even when you put all the right up you spice up everything without your contact where they are going to call you how people will locate you it means you are just pour water in the basket so at the end of the day you won't take anything home so that's why the phone number needs to be given an hierarchy as well so i made the phone number that's why the fight is long i make it uh I make it uh bold then the free delivery is not as bold as that because uh, even if I say free delivery and people were able to see it, they'll be looking for the phone number. And that's the reason why I use this line as a demarcation, as you can see, so that everything will look uniform. And this is the head of uh, design. You can see we come up with uh, something unique under 20 minutes. You can see, right? Everything cool, right? <laughs> I believe one learn something from here. Don't hesitate subscribe if you are new to my channel this is the only way of rewarding for the good deed and don't forget if you have not uh, hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any of my video if you don't want to miss any video you don't want to keep on checking just hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell icon anytime i drop a new video you will be notified you will be alerted and even if you are not online anytime you come under your notification you see many notification of my present video and you continue to grow and added more value to your skills thank you for watching if you have any question feel free to ask please feel free to ask concerning uh, this design and any other design and uh, if you want to uh, you are interested in our vip class you want to spice up your design you want to know uh, 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 the nitty gritty behind all this uh, design of a thing nobody nobody is embodiment of knowledge you can learn under four weeks you will be a boss of your own either photoshop using your android smartphone using your iphone learn specific application if you want video editing uh image editing uh learn because at time it's not about design like this alone you see after you say this you can compare what i will produce i later run with this because i'm go for that by editing this more i'm not pleased with it i need to retain the quality quality make it more spice up than this and you need to undergo many processes and what are the processes i want to use take you for instance i want to use a snapseed to edit the quality then i will go to the photo room use it to enhance the quality then i'll go to the remedy and enhance the quality i will now go back to um this application called persona i will use it to enhance it when the result come out you might design your home where you place it side by side you'll be thinking how come how this reason why my own is not look like this that is the essence of learning okay the time at time might not permit me or permit others outside there to show you everything do you understand but tip step by step we do show and that's why you should not miss any of this i've shown you several times how you can spice up your design after the whole design process you can make it more quality complete you can you can retain added more quality to it so i just do those videos separately which you might need and that's the sense of what a sense of learning directly or make sure that you follow without missing any video there is a timetable which I follow. I don't just design. I give what is uh, necessary and what is relevant. Thank you for watching. Guys, God bless you. So don't forget to save your work. That is one of the uh, prerequisites to have a, uh, uh, to retain quality. Save your dimension with Ultra. Your format should be in PNG. Thank you for once again.